Welcome to CAD 36. We will see how to make this white chute in SOLIDWORKS and we will make a how to development also. And we will see how to find the weight also for this chute. This chute. First, uh, this is our plan. So, our maximum mode is 100 mm and height is 80 mm. This is 100 mm and center to center to be 95 and this diameter is 40. And we will see how to make a development also for this chute. This is only half portion development. It is symmetric portion. So, we will make half portion development into two. We will see how to make in SOLIDWORKS. Go to the top line sketch. Make a sketch in top line and make a circle. Circle for 100 mm. This is the maximum diameter 100 mm OD. Okay, 100 mm. And for the development, we need uh, some opening. So we will make the opening for 1 mm. Okay. So make a circle for 1 mm and change the circle to construction and trim it that one. So it is open now. Okay. Then uh, you want to make uh, one more plane. So select the top plane. When you press control in your keyboard and drag it down. So you will create uh, one more plane there. So that height to be 80 mm. So select the plane and make for 80 mm and sketch sketch on the new plane and make a circle. This circle is 40 mm diameter. So make it for 40 mm. See our drawing is still in blue. So we missed some dimension. We'll make dimension from center to the whole this hole to be 95 by 2 so we will get 47.5 so same way we need to cut this circle so make a circle for 1 mm and in construction line ok and trim it this one same process then go to the trim power trim and trim it ok See, still our drawing in blue, so we need missed some relation. So select this centers and origin and make horizontal. So our drawing is fully defined now. So we'll change the dimension. So go to the dimension and trialing zero, remove the trialing zero. So you will not find any zeros in the dimension. Okay, so it's direct number. So go to the isometric and don't go this flat after the okay so go to the sheet metal and lofted bend your manufacturing method you have to select this if you go with the bend you will get the profile like miter bend what we are getting like that so you can fix the dimension for that but I will go with the rolling so rolling will go with the formed ok and my plate thickness to be 1.5 mm that 100 mm is OD so I will make the thickness inside ok yeah this is what we done and you can check flat pattern also this is the flat pattern for the cone ok this is the flat pattern for the cone ok so we have to make one more plane here this is symmetric right so we have to cut the portion so select the right plane ok select the right, right plane then go to insert features 
and make a split okay then select the right plane and cut the part so it will cut up according to the your right plane so select all the items and okay so now it is taken all the po portion to be splitted okay so now go to this cut list and right click and we have to x to we, and we have to remove this item okay so you will not find there so right click on the split area and delete this item so delete bodies delete okay in the same way not sheet 4 go to the sheet 3 expand the sheet 3 go to split and delete and delete and okay now we have done the half portion okay so we have to mirror this one go to features and mirror see mirror face or plane i have to select the plane i have to select this time right plane and features to mirror no need i want to mirror the body i will remove this merged solid i will remove the merge solid and i will accept the mirror so our white tooth is almost ready now if you check the flat pattern also you will get the development here so you will get the development here for the half portion cone okay you have to make two portion two portion so you will get this same white shoot here okay we will find the weight also for this shoot if you want to change the appearance you can go to the appearance and you can select the color as you like it's up to you you can change the color as you like for the reference I am making this colors you can make as you like ok so change to the blue color and one is in pink this is for the reference only so we will select the material first to find the weight I will select A36 material then go to eval weight mass property so you will get the weight here mass 317 kg sorry 317 gram if you go to the option you can change to the kg and change precision 3 numbers so you will get 3 precision so it is 0.3 kg ok and uh, thanks for watching please like the video and make the questions in the comment box and subscribe the channel thanks for watching